Ring, Abubakar El Bakuri from Morocco. And I have to say, well, let me just say, I'm joined by the high tower, <laughs> Sammy Schilt, Oof. K1 legend, um, joining me here at the commentary desk. And remember, Sammy, at the last century, Sveti Chanin from Serbia, he took a front kick right to the chops, which split the inside of his mouth. I didn't realize the damage at the time, but came back and knocked his opponent out with a high kick. Yeah. It was absolutely movie kind of stuff. Now he's starting off with some stiff kicks there. Now that looked a little bit awkward from yeah. the Moroccan. And Sveti Chan in here, you the can solid see. Solid kick, solid punches. He means business, doesn't he? Yeah, for sure. And I think that victory last time, it, that lifts you up. it, it lifts split you up. the inside of his mouth. He had to go to the hospital and have that stitched up. He said he's got a huge scar there now. But it ah. took him to a place where he hadn't been before. Yeah, in the hospital. Well, yeah, yeah. it took him to hospital. But it also, it's bolstered him mentally. Aye. Very dangerous knee. He needs to open up. Yeah, Bakuri, Bakuri needs to work. He needs to keep working. He needs, yeah. to, he, he needs to move. To put the pressure on. He can't stand still now. Up. Oh, that low yeah. kick is stiff. And at this weight, yeah, it's horrible, isn't it? That's an impact, yeah. Aye. There's that knee. The knee. He's yeah, very he's nimble. He's probably weighing in at 100 kilos today. Yeah. Those body it's shots there, punch, aiming at the punches. liver. Yeah. Aye. The low kick. Yeah. And the Mor yeah. oh, there's that low kick yeah. again. The Moroccan can't take too many of those. No, I don't think so. Yeah. You need to put the pressure. There it is again. Yeah, yeah good knee. He's got long shorts on, so we can't actually see the damage. But, well, no. you can just see it on the edge of the shorts. Yeah the redness and now he's starting to limp and what do you do, do well he's got to check it for a start but he, is he going to change stance i don't think so hey the calf kicks are you making calf kicks america yeah the there's le it's yeah. left a little mark hasn't it yeah But I spoke yeah. to Ernesto about that previously, and he said if anyone tried a calf kick on him, he'd break their shin. Um, I doubt it. <laughs> I, I, I dare to question that. Depend <laughs> well, depending on whose shin you're trying to break. But yeah, but, but the calf kick is not on the shin, it's on the side. It's on the, on the weaker bone. Yeah. Oh, good round, good first round. Uh, I have to say, uh, I should give the first round to uh, Shed Fakanen. <laughs> <laughs> did, you, did you mean... To the blue corner, <laughs> I mean. <laughs> yeah, man, trying to get your head around some of these names. But listen, do, do, do you know anyone from Bulgaria or Serbia who can speak Dutch? No. Pro probably not. <laughs> no. <laughs> so it's a, it's a fair point. But Milos Sveticanin from Serbia, yeah? So I'll agree with you there, Semi. Takes the first round. Yeah comfortably yeah um, and the leg that left lead leg of Bubaka El Bakuri from Morocco um, is going to be Seconds out. in agony yeah during a fight sometimes you don't feel it so much you know single shots because of the adrenaline but the accumulative round effect two. of being kicked in the thigh correctly is horrible yeah, but you have to. Uh, there he goes down. You have to keep working. You have to keep working. Standing up, that is really a bad. So. Yeah, you see, he's got to jump in already with the knee up. Yeah, M Milos is going gonna, is gonna to aim for that. We know yeah. exactly what he's going to do. Yeah, yeah. And now yeah. the Moroccan Again. cannot take much more of this. I, I think uh, three or four good ones. But you have to give the chance to get it. And you have to put pressure. 
if he wants to change the pace, he have to put the pressure now. Yeah, close the gap. Yeah. yeah. Uh, and take that distance away yeah. where the low kick can be thrown from. No, 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 no. no. Yeah, good knee. He's going to throw some punch and yeah. finish with a low kick. That's what you have to do. Well, he's, I think he's been training in Holland. Was that little um, low kick on the end of a combination. Classic of the Dutch fighters. And actually classic because it works so well. El Bakuri uh, actually also trains in the Netherlands, in, uh, Netherlands. Oh? Yeah. But not at your gym? Not at my gym, no. <laughs> no. Then I wasn't here. <laughs> I mean, let's, let's not be too unfair, you know? No, no, this is a good, this is a good, a good fight, but... He came to fight, but Sveti Chanin is, is really high level. Yeah. Well, but this, this, uh, he has to keep working. Yeah. Yeah. And actually, if Sveti Chanin gets tired here, we, we've yeah. got a minute left of the second round. The tables can turn. Anything can yeah. happen. Yeah. This, this, the guy. This, this guy's got the knockouts in the hands. Mm. You know. And Sveti Chanin does look like he's getting a little bit tired. Yeah. It's a fast pace for anyone, you know, 95 to 100 kilograms. To work at this rate is going to take it out of you. Yeah. Absolutely incredible if the, if the Moroccan could turn it round. And Milos is getting tired. He's waiting. He's waiting too much. Bang, should have thrown a low kick at the end of that. Yeah. yeah there we that's go. A good there, one. You that can see good. how damaging they are. Yeah. Last 10 seconds of the second round. And although Sveti Chanin is getting tired. Yeah, this is good action. He just finished this the round, round there well, which always Man. shines in the judges' eyes. Yeah. Difficult decision, because now you know if, if, the, if the round goes to, uh, <laughs> to the blue corner, <laughs> the, the fight is uh, it's almost set. But uh, don't uh, you have to keep uh, looking out for Bakuri, because when he's uh, starting to punch combinations and keep a uh, close distance, he's certainly got a chance. Uh, yeah, and he started firing yeah. some combinations yeah. there, which were landing. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. So it's not over yet. Absolutely not. It's not over until it's over. Yep. I mean, we used to say it's not over until the fat lady sings, but I'm not sure you can say that anymore. I think it's a little fat shaming, isn't it? It's fat yeah. shaming, so <laughs> you have know. to say it's not over. Until it's over. <laughs> <laughs> it's not over until the heavy person heavy sings. <laughs> sings, yeah, something like that. But doesn't sound so cool. No, exactly. No. So here we go, third and final round. And, well, yeah. it, look, it looked like Bakuri came out there firing, but yeah. it got shut down. Um, yeah. I mean, he's done very well to... Well, look, this is good for Bakuri. Yeah. Uh, wow. Nice try. <laughs> nice try. The, the crowd would have loved that. In fact, yeah. we would have all loved that if it had landed. Um, but Sveti Chanin... What's happening? Well, I didn't see it. I didn't see it. Low blow? Wow. Uh, that is not good. Well, what, what's tricky here, is the, uh, and the it's, other tricky one for the, it's tricky for the referee, but he's telling him to carry on. But all the time you're resting, your opponent's resting yeah. as well, so you yeah. there's no real advantage. No. Nah. <laughs> if you get really get kicked in the nuts, it's an advantage to wait a little bit. <laughs> well, but it's a okay. big advantage for the opponent. And, and well, he, he shouldn't go box with him. He shouldn't stay kicking. He should stay kicking because he's getting in trouble now. Yeah, and, and uh, Bakuri is gaining confidence by yeah. the second here with these yeah. combinations. Yeah. Look, uh, he's tired. And a low kick knocks Sveti Chanin down. No, it was not a low kick. 
Well, Sveti Channon needs yeah. to uh, work now. He needs to make a comeback because he's losing this third and final round. Yeah. Um, he's still two rounds ahead, but actually, the way this is going, with one and a half minutes to go, it's getting dangerous for him. He's head hunting with the knees. And the confidence will actually yeah. take away the pain from that left leg yeah. somewhat and give him some hope. Uh, they're both tired now. Yeah. I mean, it's incredible how the, how the fight is... Uh, it's evolving. Yeah. Yeah. If he gets a sweep and a knee afterwards, it can be really dangerous. And Milos Speti Chan in here needs to take a deep breath. He's out, he overworked himself in those early parts of the fight. Um, but fair play to Bukhari, Bukhari who took Bukhari some punishment. Yeah. Uh, what, what a, a warrior. Comeback. What a comeback. Whoops a daisy. Oh. Sorry, ref. Up you get, fella. There we go. Last 16. 15 seconds. There we Ten go. Seconds, 10, seconds 10 seconds to go. Seconds. They're going to go for it. Surely, last few seconds. Come on, guys. Give the crowd what they want to see. Ah. There we see it again. Good oh, that try. was a shame. Good try. Good try. Well, what a fantastic fight. Raise your hand, man. Raise um, your hand. Yeah, and a full credit to... Boubacar El Bakuri from Morocco making his Senshi debut here at over 95 kilograms. And, uh, you know, not wanting to be critical, but just look at him. He could fight at a slightly lighter weight. Yeah. Um, Milos Sveti Chan in here, who's a fan favorite, he's got dynamite in his kicks, but he ran out of gas. Yeah. Um, I hope for him. Not, I hope it's not an <laughs> extra round for him. To be, honest, to be honest. My goodness. That, that would be terrible for that him. That didn't even cross my mind. Well, I've got it two rounds to yeah. one. I'm going to give the, that final round to the red corner. Yeah. So, the judges. Well, it. Semi, you've thrown a spanner in the works there because if it goes to a fourth round, I think Sveti Channing's going to be in trouble. We are going to see. It goes judge number one, 29 to 28. Oi. In favor of the blue corner, judge two, 30, 28. Judge three, 30, 28. For yeah, yeah, you got it. In favor of the blue corner. Yeah. Wow. So. Well, you got me all excited. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you did that on purpose just to dramatize things. <laughs> well, that would have been fantastic, but you know, Milos Sveti Chanin, I think he's got huge, huge potential. He can become a superstar in this game. But whatever happened tonight with his conditioning needs to be addressed yes because he's got the tools he's got the skills but if you haven't got the gas tank to keep it going it doesn't matter what you've got um, in your arsenal el, el bakuri started too late with the uh, with the uh, punching he should have put the pressure a little bit earlier in the second round because the second round kicks. was already yeah yeah i agree but up. those low kicks were just nasty yeah for uh, sure so he won't be going for his morning run tomorrow that's for sure no. <laughs> but but what a fight he put up. Um, and actually, once he got going with his punches, he uh, certainly came to fight, didn't he?